National Science Foundation funded anthropologists and paleontologists uncovered what could be the largest single collection of lemur remains ever found. The ancient graveyard and other deposits were discovered hidden in a series of underwater caves in a remote desert region of Madagascar in the Semana Pasuts National Park. Here, complete skeletons have remained intact for hundreds, if not thousands of years, making this one of the most unique sites in the world. The project was also funded by the National Geographic and was led by Brooklyn College anthropologist Alfred Rosenberger. It's really an enormous number of fossils all in one place, so it's accessible. They're very complete, as, which is unusual in paleontology because you get broken bones frequently or you get different parts of the body separated from one another. Here, everything is together in beautiful condition. But the possibilities here of making very important, exciting discoveries is, is phenomenal because nothing like this has ever been found before. An international team of cave divers led by Philip Lehman of the Dominican Republic Speleological Society dove into three large underground caves, Malazamanga, Mitutu, and Ovin, all of which contained fossil remains. However, it was in Ovin, a cave originally explored by team member Ryan Dart, where they retrieved the remains of an unprecedented number of recently extinct lemurs, as well as many other animals. Well, we found an extraordinary variety of animals represented as fossils in the fossil graveyard. We have many lemurs, all extinct. We have bats. We have rodents. We have carnivores. A, a very nice cross-section of the fauna that, that occupied that part of Madagascar. The team said one of the most surprising finds was of a beautiful skull of one of the largest of the recently extinct giant lemurs. Well, one of the nicest things that we discovered in Malazamanga is a very beautiful skull sitting on the silty surface at the bottom of the cave of an animal called Megalatopus. Megalatopus is a fascinating critter. Um, it's kind of like the koala bear lemur. It had a very large skull, about a foot long in size, and a very stocky kind of robust body. The team says the discovery of the fossil graveyard will help us understand our relatives and ourselves. If we want to understand ourselves, we need to understand our relatives. We need to understand apes, we need to understand monkeys, and we need to understand tarsiers, we need to understand lemurs. While it will take some time to comb through the fossils, the researchers are confident that the find will also help us understand what the environment was like in Madagascar and what led to the extinction of these animals. When you have a place where two-thirds of the animals that lived there only a thousand years ago are gone and replaced with the other animals that humans brought in, what we need to know is so what are the implications for the rest of the fauna and flora that remain? The discovery of these caves is significant for Madagascar's past and future. This will result in a totally new era of underwater paleontology, opening up new opportunities for research. This was really a remarkable discovery. I think it's, it, I'm very happy personally that we found it, but I think it's going to be wonderful for science and future generations. 